good day to you from Wallox, an expert in low energy ventilation. Here we have a nice and very very lovely apartment. As you can see, it has two bedrooms, living room, toilet, hall and kitchen. It must be so nice to live in this kind of apartment. But, hey, wait a minute, now wait a minute, something is missing, what can it be? Oh, now I get it, there's no ventilation. No ventilation, no ventilation, there's no ventilation, baby. Bummer. That is truly a bad news for people who are living in this apartment. For air to stay fresh, it should be replaced with outdoor air once in two hour time. And without ventilation, it can be that air is just not changed at all. Also, moisture needs to be taken out from the apartment, so we would really appreciate good ventilation. Okay, we have now heard the bad news. Do we have any good news? Yes, we do. You know, Valox is manufacturing TSK multi-ventilation unit and that unit is very well suited for apartments. We can also use Valox Blue Sky air distribution system because then we can use flexible ducts and that will really help us, especially in situations where space is tight. If we think about this apartment, there is no utility room or technical room available. And we surely don't want to install ventilation machine to the corner in our living room. No way man, that is just unacceptable. But yet another good news is that we don't really need the utility room or technical room since we can manage without them. For example, we can easily build a suspended ceiling to the whole area. That way we can mount the ventilation unit and other equipment to the ceiling in the hall. We will use suspended ceiling area also for other equipment like silencers, air distribution boxes and ducts. Let's first install the ventilation unit. In this case it will be Wallox TSK Multi 15. Don't forget to install condensing water seal. Ok, so we now have a ventilation unit installed to the ceiling in the hall. Next we will install silencers. After that we can install Blue Sky Air distribution boxes. Besides supply and extract air ducts, Ventilation unit also needs outdoor air duct and exhaust air duct. We already have supply and extract air ducts, but how in earth do we get outdoor and exhaust air ducts to the outside? Do we somehow take them out to the roof maybe? Hmm, huh, that would be hard. Fortunately, we don't have to do that. We are going to blow exhaust air outside from the apartment using Valox out in wall hood. And we will also get outside air to ventilation unit from the same spot. Like this. Wow. Now back to the hall. We will bring supply air to bedrooms and to the living room. We will extract air from toilet, kitchen and hall. Let's first install the supply air vents. We will use supply air vents that has 75mm outlets, so it's fully compatible with the Valox Blue Sky ducts. For the extract air vents, we will use the same principle, except 
for the hole where we will use blue sky connection part for side connection. As you can see, in this case the main area for implementing ventilation system was hole. One could also mount ventilation unit to kitchen. Next we are going to build a suspended ceiling to the hole. Don't forget that you will need a hatch so you can access the ventilation unit for maintenance. Also, don't forget to install pipe for condensing water. So we are now almost done. Last thing to do is to do something about the outdoor and exhaust air ducts. We can, for example, encapsulate outdoor and exhaust air ducts and use that same space for lighting as well. For example like this. Oh yeah, now we are all done. This nice little apartment just became a much better place to be. Because now we have good ventilation. Think about it. Human consumes about 1 kg of food and about 2 liters of liquid daily. But human also consumes at least 15,000 liters of air every day. So it's a great idea to have a good ventilation system. Thank you for watching this video. For more information, please visit our website at www.pallox.com.